Hey, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children, adults, oldsters. It's Bobo the Vulture. This is Fallout Shelter. I want to welcome everybody here. I want to welcome the people that are on uh, stream well, right now that are. Forward to future vids. I never came across the Jeep. Delicious Fallout bread. Uh, yeah, so it's time for the bread in this uh, <laughs> in this Big Mac, <laughs> which is unavailable at your local Burger King. It's that third bun, the one that everybody's after. Yeah, the Fallout Jeep. Oh, Hazel. Hazel decided to climb up on my lap slash stomach in my reclined state. Which is cool. Blanca. <laughs> no, <laughs> Blanca has three buttocks, but not actually three butts. There's just two butts, I think. <laughs> I don't really know how Blanca's physiology works. All right, just one more days of evaluation, and I think we will get a uh, lunchbox. Each buttock is a bun, though, right? I don't know. Our hot dogs, uh, sandwiches, and are all circles and rectangles. <laughs> that last one should be very easy. Exactly. <laughs> um, do we have anybody not doing a job right now? That's weird. I thought we had an extra person not doing a job right grass. now. <laughs> That's all right. I don't care if hot dogs are sandwiches. <laughs> That's just blasphemy. <laughs> I care if cereal and milk is soup. Level two for Natalie Rice. Okay, guys. Uh, there's uh, lots more vaulting going on here. Tell you what. Water is lava. Soup. It's cold. I mean, could be. Gazpacho. Oh no, feral ghouls. Don't ask for your gazpacho soup to be uh, served to you warm. You'll so be very embarrassed. Or magma if it is in the pipes. You need a hanging pot to make cereal. Hanging <laughs> pot to make cereal, damn it. Damn it all, Chatsu. Let's get you in here to help out with the, uh... So these guys die quick. I don't consider gazpacho soup either. <laughs> you don't consider it? Please, consider gazpacho soup the next time you're making food. I mean, you're a little irradiated. I guess. Just that the next time you level up, you won't uh, have uh, any issues with uh, not getting a full heal. Hey, kitty. You know, why don't you take... Let's unequip Gizmo from you. Give Amber the Hamber Gizmo. Bring Amber the Hamber down here. Oh, level up. Bring Wolfman Kevin over here. I particularly like the pairing of Amber the Hamber and Wolfman Kevin because. I find it easy to keep track of anybody whose last name is The Hamber as being a child of Amber the Hamber or Wolfman Kevin. Well, and Wolfman Kevin, I should say. But, uh... I haven't rushed you guys into doing any more uh, operation lately. Let's tempt fate. 
Great tempting fate, everybody. At least it's only rad roaches. You know those are Vulcan ears, right? <sighs> yeah, because it's a sci-fi fan outfit. However, Lethal very authoritatively declared him a damn werewolf. And so, <laughs> he is a wolf man. Anyways, still going to take you three bottles of uh, Nuka Cola to get here. As I do most things. <laughs> you, mo you declare most things Wolfmen authoritatively? Where right. words like logic too. Knight armor. And railroad living quarters. Getting an idea of what they look like. Don't they look comfy and luxurious? Let's take a look at the quest list right now. Spy on Raiders. We get two new Coca-Colas from this daily quest. We would need to wear Raider armor. Search the nuclear power power plant Paula Plumpkin. Could kill the mole rat brood mother and win a legendary two mil legendary lime nine millimeter lime millimeter nine millimeter handgun. Two of you already have raider armor on, don't you? You have sturdy raider armor. You have Sturdy Raider armor. Where's the other one of you? I feel like the other one of you had some kind of battle armor or something. We could just get you some Raider armor, though. That wouldn't be that big a deal. And then we could go do that Raider mission. It promises Nuka Cola Quantums, armor, which means. AKA armor. armor. There's also legendary armor, which I guess would be Larmor. Put the lime millimeter in the coconut. Cynthia, I didn't see what you were wearing. No, you are wearing sturdy raider armor. It's not you. Was it Susan? No, she had sturdy raider armor. I guess it was Anna. Anna, what are you wearing? You're wearing sturdy battle armor. Okay, so we gotta find you some raider armor. Do we have any here without taking any off of anybody else? We have regular raider armor. I'd rather not put you in something, so... Oh, well, there you go. Congratulations, Wolfman Kevin. Now go to the next match. Oh, sweet roll mystery is happening here. It's true. Don't mess with anybody's sweet roll. Everybody is, uh... <laughs> so, so wait a minute. The, uh, Maria there was singing about somebody stealing her sweet roll. Jeremy, from the audience, was... Rumor has it you'll be the next overseer. Okay. What does the bar do? The bar increases their charisma. So uh, that's raising their charisma stats. No school, no babysitter, this is the life. Well, okay, it's a daily quest. Who knows what mystery things we will find. It allows people to walk into it. Yes, but only in groups of three. Let's go ahead and start the quest. Delicious. Spy on Raiders. <laughs> Let's have a delicious spy on Raiders, everyone.
Wait, we're spying on the raiders. It seems like maybe the worst possible thing to do would be to go up to their leader and engage them in conversation. Only if they are a religious caricature, though, probably. Well, this is a new background, guys. I haven't seen this. Oh. Maybe it's a cult of people that uh, were inspired by her TOEFL boyfriend, and uh, the leader will say, There you go. This is new excitement for everybody. These guys are packing a punch, though. Spy. Yeah, we're doing good spying here, everyone. Is Fallout Online a thing? Uh, you mean Fallout 76? Fallout 76 is online. I do believe. Spy their bloody guts, I guess. Our bullets are spying on their innards. <laughs> bullets are spying on them. That's, that's true. Well, and our gauss shots. I don't even know exactly what kind of, uh... Boy, having both of these elevators here sure was useful, wasn't it? What do we have here? Looking to join our gang? We're called the Screeching Falcons. Big scary birds. You got it? Screeching Falcons, sure. So you got a shock call when you go into battle. You no got that? No online on China server, not 76 at S on mobile B. That's the dumbest thing we've ever heard of. Kaka! Actually, we're evolved to all in disguise. We're here to spy on you. This is actually a very difficult choice because this makes it seem like you're not trying to blend in. This. I believe Gauss is magnetically accelerated projectiles. Oh, so it's like a railgun or something? Um, Vulture in disguise, we're here to spy on you. That's obviously not very stealthy. And Kaka would imply that you're about to attack him. Oh well, Kaka! That's the spirit, go on ahead. Now, does this mean that any raiders that we encounter through the rest of the, uh... Talk to raiders, talk to raiders, talk to the raider boss. Any raiders that we encounter from here on out won't actually attack us? Are you playing console? Are we sure they aren't really Gauss rifles? Yeah, they shoot, uh, they shoot gauze. Nope, these guys will still attack us. Apparently these aren't the true raiders. And, uh, let's see. Rebel Games, uh, yes. We are, this is the, this is the PS4. In case you were wondering, talk to raiders. Version. Yeah, we talked to the raiders. Got a lot of caps. There's that. Nothing going on in there. Clear the next room. There's a lot of dust and flies and something in here. But, okay. No enemies to speak of. Let's keep moving. Cacao! Cacao! Boy. We sure are good at blending into this band of raiders, aren't we? Synchronized dying. Well done, everyone. Gaining some relatively good junk, anyway. Sir. 
synchronized dying is hard because you can't practice. I mean, you can practice with le petit mort. In fact, a lot of people try and do that together. When you can manage to synchronize that, it's pretty interesting. Kaka! Welcome to the Screeching Falcons, fledglings! Don't underestimate Screeching Falcons! You seem like nice kids. I hope this raider doesn't chew you up like it did for me. The raider life, I should say. I've lost a lot of friends. It's never too late to turn your life around. Kaka. Could you say that again? We have to write it down because we're spying on you. You know what? We're just gonna kill you. Hey man, let's be let's be kind and uh, rewind. Night all. Night, JG. Night, JG. It's never too late to turn your life around. Hey, you know you're right. Time to live for me. See ya. We talked to some raiders. Apparently convinced them to turn their lives around. Whether that means leaving raiderdom or not, I don't know. Let's head down. Continue our systematic sweep of Raiderland USA. Getting a lot of stim packs. Wait a second. Was, uh... Is that a flamer? That was a rusty flamer. Which uh, sounds like something that you can get on shore leave. Okay. Still, not the best weapon, but if these ones, these folks had had any others. Stand before Beaks, leader of the Screeching Still Falcons. No I suppose you're here for your share of our last raid? That's right, and we'd love some new weapons. We need medical supplies, boss. How about some junk? We're feeling crafty. Die, raider scum. Hmm, do we want weapons or do we want junk? Or do we want to just kill this guy? Hmm, let's get junk. It's likelier to be good junk, I feel like. New weapons, it could just be any old random. About some junk, we're feeling crafty. Suppose we can spare some supplies, now go! Wow, okay. That's legendary junk. That was a giddy up buttercup. No turning back now, that's right. Even though we've accomplished all the objectives, there's still more place to explore. Almost totally synchronized, guys. You're very close. A lot of good coming out of this little uh, quest here, though. Quest arena. Okay, not a whole lot here, but uh, that's okay. Don't worry, folks. There is still plenty of hideout left. There's not that much hideout left, although watch this. We can go here without even exploring that room. Kaka. To die. All right.
You ever feel like life is just an illusion? Do you ever feel like you've been tricked by some kind of illusion? I'll just pause on a game. I can't leave this that way, though. But what if there are goodies in there? I know. What if there's something exciting going on in this elevator shaft? There's something in this room that I didn't notice the first time around. A scoped magnum, which isn't amazing, but uh, is something. All right, we've done everything here. Let's get back to the vault. We got a giddy up buttercup, which seems like it will be very useful for some very expensive crafting material later on. Let's get back to that vault, everybody. Get on back. Only take them one to get back, I guess. Oh, we have a low water supply. Well, hush up. I will get you some water. I apparently do guitar riffs when they level up. In the bar? It's a rock bar, I guess. PFF water. Who needs that? Seems overrated. Overhyped. Let's see. Another water treatment plant down here. Let me go peruse the missions, see what I would send them off to do next. I would like to get another Mr. Handy, but they are not experienced enough to go out for that. What is the thing that they would be most... Kind of everything they would go after right now would be... Uh, Take about two or three hours, so I'm not really getting any. Another you know, the mysterious disappearing spuds would take slightly longer. Where's the scary guy? I don't even know. There, why don't you speed up? Nice job. Hey, that put us in a normal amount of water again. Hooray! Now, what if I hurry them back just so that I get them started on something else? Seems okay. The Institute Diner. Isn't it fancy looking? So I'm not going to be up another two hours or three and a half hours or anything like that anyway. Junk shooter would be a good weapon. So we could search a power plant for Paul Plumpkin. Hmm. Tato Blight or find Paul Plumpkin. None of these should disappear, so they've got that going for them. The rats creep, scorpions, creepy keepers at Paul Plum. We went to the nuclear power plant, so that's where we'll look for her. Okay. I tell you what. First, raiders should come and attack.
No, I don't need the experience. I need, uh, I need to teach people inside the vault to learn how to deal with these jokers. Take care of them yet? Good job. I was afraid for a second that was one of our residents that had been killed. But no, thank goodness. Alright, Anna Bush. First of all, let's get you a stim pack. And you're just wearing regular uh, raider armor. Why don't you give you some kind of sturdy armor? In theory, if I were trying to min-max you guys for all time, I would be giving you something like the Sturdy Wasteland gear to increase your endurance, but you guys are not going to be there, so let's just go ahead and give you some fairly regular stuff. Now then. Whatever, let's search the power plant for Paul Plumpkin. Oh, right. I wanted to heal them all up. That was the whole point. Or close to it. Ah, she's close enough. And we're low on water again. Make water faster. Don't fail to make water faster. Don't set water on fire. That's not helpful to this process in any way, shape, or form. At least you guys made some water. <laughs> Make water. Come on, setting fire to dirty water makes steam. Steam well, it makes dirty water. steam. Hello. Hello. Always great to see you. Really. I don't know if these folks are just... This is just how stilted people talk in uh, Vault Land, or uh, there's an air of sarcasm happening there. Sarcasm, eh? Anyways, let's send these folks out. Uh, let's send them out to the nuclear power plant. There are no extra pets hanging out. Go ahead and send them off on their quest. If I'm inspired to later, I will uh, come back and uh, visit them and accelerate their progress. Otherwise, it'll get done when it gets done. Speaking of things getting done, we could craft another rare weapon. You know, I'm gonna... Mm, I'm gonna drop this Deathclaw attack one. 
have 12 male-female couples dance in the living quarters. Well, that'll be an activity to get going next time. I can get started on that right now. Wolfman Kevin, why don't you come in here into the room? And uh, we'll find... Uh, Well, Shaker McGee's got work to do. Bring Angela Frost's down. You want to have a sleepover tonight? No. The uh, Daddy Wolfman this Kevin has like other plans. For. Wolfman Kevin. Actually, dancing you will find is something that you can have everybody do. Uh, it's just that you want to immediately stop them the moment they start dancing. Because for anything to go farther than that could just lead to the vault of ruin. Actually, having everybody related uh, in the vault um, like biologically doesn't have any impacts than this game simulation. However, um, it does prevent you from having fully statted up level 50 people. Um having kids together. I suppose we could just get Wolfman Kevin up to level 50 and max out his stats. Come on, Bottle. I know you've got more Nuka-Colas in you. I suppose we will continue to do the Bottle and Cappy quest, and then that'll be, uh... will be the extent of this app. Where's this old boy getting down? There he is. Once your vault gets big enough, it's real hard to keep track of what Bottle and Cappy are up to. Come on, Bottle. Stop holding out on me. Also, Bottle already peacing out? Well, fine, Bottle. Be like that. I'm here for the moment you decide to start dancing. Nope, you have decided you're probably going to follow him, aren't you? Okay, well that was an exciting visit by Bob and Cappy, everyone. We come back next time, Dance Party USA. But uh, that'll be it for YouTube land. Everybody, stay tuned on the stream.